Hello YouTube. Um, today I want to talk to you about what I did with my hair. Last Wednesday I went to a salon and got a um, it's called a smooth and healthy protein treatment. Um, what it is is supposed to I got the deep freeze bath supposedly the deep deep freeze bath. Well, instead of it deep freezing, I basically got almost straight hair. Okay, um, it's okay. I did not do a. It's not a chemical. It's not a relaxer. It's all. Um, it's all proteins. Um, it was mainly like bamboo oil um, and some some other ingredients I can't remember the name of all the stuff that was in it but I will put the link on at the bottom so therefore you can look at it they carry if you some of y'all may have heard of the um, they carry the surface product line but basically this treatment is supposed to last in my hair four to six weeks and then my hair reverts back to its natural um, natural state. Um, my ends, some of my ends are a little, I have a little, some very, very, very few curls. Very, very few. I definitely can say, as you can tell, my hair is limp. It hangs. That's one of the effects of the protein treatment. Um, I think, well, not think, it cost me uh, actually $35 for the treatment um, it didn't take long basically what she did was she put the product in my hair and she left it in about three minutes she did it she had you know break it down into four quadrants and um, she left it in for about three minutes and then she rinsed it out and then she did something else I can't remember what it was for like seven minutes and then she rinsed it out uh, it um, it didn't smell too good but um like I said four to six weeks it's been in my hair for a week so far but I want to tell you about the products that I use with it I'm not too fond of anybody's shampoos so I did not buy the shampoo I mean I was supposed to but I refused to buy it but I did buy their um surface trinity protein cream I don't know if you can see that it's a four ounce bottle. Um, I'm supposed to use this every day. Um, it's a pretty thick consistency. It's pretty thick. But um, it smells really, really, really good. And it makes your hair really soft. So I really like this product. Um, the only thing about this product is that it was $18. But like I said, um, it's really, it's, it smells really good and it works really well on my hair. Uh, so what I decided to do to make, since this cost $18, I was going to make this product last. So I decided that I was going to dilute it into my little daily moisturizing mixture. So therefore, it won't, I won't use it up too quickly. So I did that today. So I'm going to try it out on my hair. But I do want to tell you also about their um, hydrating conditioner, Basu hydrating conditioner. You can see that by surface. And um, it's supposed to soften, detangle, and provide shine. Um, I just, like I said, washed my hair and I loved it. It is um, a really, really good conditioner. I have been trying it out on small sections of my hair just, you know, kind of get a feel of, you know, this conditioner. However, it's a six ounce bottle and it cost me $25. So, um, I won't be buying it again. I won't be buying it again. But I will say that I will most likely buy this again. Because I like this. I really, really like this. It smells real good. Um, so for the next couple of weeks, I'm going to probably uh, do a little updates. Um, yeah, do a couple, you know, a few updates so you can see how my hair is turning out. Um, <laughs> see how long it takes my curls to revert back because I was this close 
gonna throw some braids in it. So I said, no, nope, I'm gonna wait it out and let my hair revert back and see, you know, maybe in about two, three weeks, maybe it'll be something that I really liked. Um, I was a little upset because of the fact that it made my hair so straight. I was not expecting that. Um, she knew that I was not too happy with it. Um, she knew that I wasn't too happy with it, so. But for the most part, my hair is a lot more manageable. Um, but the purpose of me going in there was to get um, to get rid of some of the frizz and a little more curl definition. That's what was supposed to happen. But that's not what happened. That's not what happened at all. So. Hmm. Looks like some of my stuff is starting to come back a little bit. Just a little bit. But, you know, we'll see how it all turns out um, in the long run. But what I did after I, um, I washed my hair, um, I used a conditioner and, and I mixed a little bit of oils in it to put more moisture. And then I did like a little herbal rinse. That's something new that I just started. I kind of brewed some um, nettle burdock and horsetail. And I just used it as a final rinse and I didn't rinse it out. So um, I'm going to uh, see how that all pans out. And I'm going to post the link at the bottom so you can see um, um, what these herbs are supposed to do with regards to your hair. And, you know, I have a couple, a lot more videos coming up um, that I need to make, um, some more product reviews. So be looking out for that in the next couple of days. So, um, other than that, that is all I have. Hopefully in the next, hopefully soon I'll be, um, oh, another thing about this product, this, um, protein treatment is that it made, to me, it made my hair look dull. My hair look, to me, my hair looks dull. Um, it don't look like it has a shine or anything. So... I don't know because the protein coated my hair or what, but it made it look dull. But I am going to go and uh, do something with this stuff. Something. I don't know what, but yeah, but I'm going to do something. And I will come back later and do my product review. Okay. So that's all I have. Take care. And I'll see you soon. Bye.